lose their way. A young San Francisco woman who was nearly killed in a hit and run accident earlier this year and overwhelmed by medical bills delivered an emotional message today. KTVU's Rob Roth was at City Hall and he joins us now live. Rob. Julie, the young woman was just walking home when a car plowed right into her. Today, her message to the Board of Supervisors, do more to protect the safety of pedestrians. So this doesn't happen to one of my loved ones, or to you, or to one of your loved ones. I plead with you to help me change some of the policies here in San Francisco that concern us all. 26-year-old Monique Porsande was struck as she crossed Green and Fillmore streets last February. The driver of what police believed was a 2008 to, two to a 2012 Honda Accord struck her and her friend in the crosswalk and sped away. The driver has never been caught. Monique suffered a shattered pelvis, fractured vertebrae, a broken leg, and she suffered a brain injury. She was in the hospital for months and doesn't remember much about the accident. But today she wanted to speak to the Board of Supervisors during public comments to ask them to make pedestrian safety a higher priority. One, make sure all traffic signs are visible. Two, make sure pedestrian walkways are well lit, clearly marked, and unobstructed. Pedestrian accidents in San Francisco are on the rise. There were almost a thousand accidents in 2012, about a hundred more than in 2011. Monique says her medical bills are approaching $200,000. She says she expects a full recovery, but she also is concerned that she may have to declare bankruptcy. Reporting live in San Francisco, Rob Roth, KTVU, Channel 2.